In this video, I'll cover how to create a Squarespace lightbox with an image. To begin, visit the spacetutorials.com website and click on the Squarespace lightbox with image tutorial. I'm going to assume you've already completed step one, the initial setup of a Squarespace lightbox. If not, pause this video and complete the initial setup of a Squarespace lightbox. For step two, we're going to create the hyperlink that opens up the lightbox. So highlight the code and then copy. Go to your Squarespace website and for the page that will contain this lightbox, we'll choose that page and then click on edit. Add a new block, choose the code block, remove the code that's there, and then paste in the code that we copied from the tutorial. Go back to your Squarespace tutorial. And for step three, we're going to copy the code that creates the actual light box. So highlight the code copy the code, go back to your Squarespace website, and then below the code that we inserted from step two, we'll paste in the code from step three. So we've got the code that creates the hyperlink for the light box, and then we've got the code that is the light box. Click Apply, and then click Save. Now, to use your own photo in the Lightbox, we'll need to upload it to Squarespace. What I recommend doing is creating a new page under the Not Linked section. Click the plus sign, choose Page, and I'll call this Web Assets. Click Start Editing. We'll add a new block. And we'll choose the Grid Gallery. So in this Grid Gallery, this is where I'm going to upload all the photos I'm going to use throughout all of my light boxes. Click Upload Images. Choose the photo we want to use. After it's done uploading, click Apply and then click Save. Now we're going to need to copy the URL of this image. So right click on the image, choose Copy Image Address, go to our Lightbox page, click the Edit button, click on the Edit button for that code block, And here we're going to highlight the code for the image that was provided in the code from the tutorial. Since we want to use our own photo, we'll delete the URL of that image. And then we'll paste in the code of the photo we want to use. Since I don't want to use the image size format that's included with Squarespace photo links. I'll highlight that, delete that, and also delete the question mark. So now it ends in .png, which is the file extension of this image. Click Apply, click Save. Since we're in edit mode, we'll click the refresh button. After you've refreshed the page, we should now be able to click on View John's bio and the light box would appear. So we've got the light box and the photo we want to use. We'll close out. Now, if I want to modify this light box to say View Jerry's bio, we'll click Edit, click Edit, and we'll remove John and put in Jerry. So view Jerry's bio and this ID 
You don't have to change it, but in this case, I'm going to change it from John to Jerry. Since I did change it up here for the link, I'll then change it for the light box. So bio Jerry, bio Jerry. And then I'll remove John Smith and replace it with Jerry Seinfeld. Okay. And then make any other changes you want to make to his bio. When you're done, click apply, click save. We'll refresh the page once more. So we'll click on view Jerry's bio. And then now the light box appears and we can see Jerry Seinfeld. And that's the Squarespace Lightbox image tutorial.